I honestly was not aware as well, right? I was not. But the moment I began to make sense out of it, the moment I began to to pray about it, you know, the moment I began to try to reason it all out, it began to make sense. Some things you will understand why it will be the case as long as, you know, sometimes we sit down and as a Christian, you will ask, I'm like, you'll be like, why are people like this though? Why can't we all love each other? Why can't we all love? You know what I mean? But the bottom line is this. When you are at work, when you are at school, around, there are things that causes people to do so. And of course, the wicked one, demons, the evil one, inspires them to motivate them, to put it simple. That is why when you're at work, of course, everyone, nobody wants to stay in one position as long as there are different positions. Someone, everyone wants to get on top. That is the human nature. Unless if all the positions were the same, nobody would, would bother. You will all get along. And let me let me be honest with you. If at schools a pass is a pass, no 80%, no, as long as you go, went across this line, you are done. Nobody else who passes were gonna compete. But of course, those who get below, they were gonna start to worry. That's yeah, so there it could not be avoided. But then, if at school, for example, there is no such thing as failing. As long as you attended the classes, as long as you wrote, you all pass, nobody would compete. So the bottom line is you compete because jealousy grows because you want to do better. Cain and Abel. Cain got jealous because Abel's sacrifices of Abel were accepted better. But I like the fact that God told him that if you were to do good, wouldn't it not be accepted? Hmm? To show that he was not doing good. That is why it was not taken in the same manner as Evels. So the bottom line is, at your workplace, you might have somebody who is against you. Wherever you go, around you, these are some of the factors and the causes. But I pray that in Jesus' mighty name, wherever you are, whoever is against you, let God begin to fight your battles. Whoever wants to poison you or to put you down, to get you fired, let their advances fade in the name of jesus christ amen and of course you can book an appointment with me my details and comment section below see you next time